Hi everybody, this is Yudita and Yoga Life Happy Life. I am in China uh, Airport Hotel and I just want to share a very quick routine with you, uh, which is super simple and which I actually do every day even though I don't have any time. It takes literally like two to five minutes, I don't know, it depends how much uh, you spend with it. You, you actually can spend, you can spend only just one minute with it. The point of this video is to show you how to uh, make your body feel more alive within literally one to five minutes, maybe not even. So just stand up and just relax, you know, see like your body is usually tense, you don't even know about it, so just relax, okay? So stand up straight, most important thing, always remember the inner power is going up. Even now, right now, I'm just standing, doing nothing, but I feel like I'm going up. Not physically, but uh, again, it comes from within. And what we do is just like, we wake up our neck. So still your spine is very straight. And just uh, stay there and breathe. Imagine that you're breathing into your back and your back is, big, is getting bigger and bigger and bigger with every inhale. And exhale, just relax and just actually lose all your stress and everything, all your expectations. And everything that is making you hard is making you opposite of relaxed. And just then uh, pull it to the right. Your chin is a little bit tilted to the right. And still keep breathing to your back. So your back is getting bigger. And with your exhale, you're just uh, relaxing and letting go of everything. Inhale and exhale the other side. Same thing, diagonal. Your chin is going to your armpit and you're breathing. Inhale, huge back, extend your back, just with your inhale and exhale, just relax. Inhale and exhale, once more in the center. And inhale, go up and stretch your arms all the way up and now three inhales into your chest, into your heart. So inhale, expand to your chest and really enjoy it, like you want to fly up. And exhale, and two more times. Just inhale and enjoy it. Open up basically. Exhale and one more. And exhale. So right now interlace your fingers behind your back. Inhale, pull the arms a little bit more up or lift them up a little bit, very gently. And while you're doing it, pull your chest a little bit forward, but be careful not to lose your belly, your abs or your center, your core. It's still there. So inhale. Your arms are going up, your chest is going a little bit forward, but your belly is still strong and exhale, just let it go. And inhale, imagine that you're breathing into your heart and there's light, and there's light. One more time. Inhale, open up, really enjoy it and exhale, let it go. Now interlace your fingers at the front, inhale, and exhale around your back and just uh, hide your head between your arms and three inhales and exhales into your back. Imagine that your back is a balloon and you want to make it bigger with every inhale. So inhale, your back is bigger and exhale, let it go. Inhale, huge back, really it's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And exhale, let go. And last time, inhale and exhale. Inhale up, look up. And again, feel like you want to fly all the way up and open up your armpits. And exhale, let go. So you see like you already feel much more alive. Inhale and exhale, just take it to the side. Really extend your belly, your core is still there, is strong. And breathe three times into your ribs. The side doesn't matter what side you start with. I, I uh, like to start with my left side because I'm a woman but it really like it's up to you. It's better to listen to your feelings because that might actually change every day as well. But the point is that you're gonna with every inhale you're gonna extend your ribs like you want to make the ribs more far apart. Inhale and more stretch more like feel it more like you want to feel your body and last time inhale exhale and then with inhale, you're going up and exhale the other side. But really feel it. Feel what you're doing. That's the point. Thank you. Thank you. Let's check. <laughs> inhale. And your ribs are going even more far apart than they probably already are. So inhale. And exhale like you're letting go. Like you're relaxing in what you're doing and you're feeling it more deep. Last time, inhale, exhale. And inhale. 
So, again, interlace your fingers behind your back and inhale. Open up your chest and exhale. Make sure nobody is behind you. And just take it to the front. Stay there. Relax. Relax your shoulders. Relax your legs. And inhale. Have the feeling like you're breathing through your legs. And I'm not joking. I know physically it's probably not possible, but I think it's possible mentally and it's just a mental focus and it really helps and it works because I've tried it. Works for me and it will probably work for you if you do it with open heart and open mind. So inhale through your legs, through the back side of your legs. And exhale, let it go. One more time. Inhale. It's your legs breathing for you. And exhale, let it go. And inhale, you take it up. Open up your chest again and exhale. Back once more, round your back and three inhales, exhales into your back. Huge back, balloon. Air balloon is getting bigger with every inhale and exhale, letting go. And inhale, take it up. And we are left with our legs. So take your again, like if you, if you feel like starting with your right one, start with your right one. If you feel like starting with your left one, start with your left one. And just bring it backwards. Again, your core is strong, and again, you are still growing up. <laughs> That's nice, right? Yeah, we are always growing up, always. Never ending story. But right now, feel the lifting, like the movement, again, comes from within. Remember the lesson about the inner power. Still working even now, even now in China Hotel. <laughs> and inhale through your thigh, through the thigh that you're stretching. Inhale, and exhale. Let go. Last time, inhale and exhale let it go take it to the front and pull your knee towards your belly three inhales exhales and then go let's do the other side inhale through your other thigh again the thigh that you're stretching is breathing for you basically so what you're doing is that you're working for uh, with your focus so that means you're putting you know where you focus the fo where the focus goes uh, that's the place where it's blooming when it's starting to lift and so that's why what we focus on that's getting bigger is the very famous uh, sentence um so this is exactly what we want to do we want our tie uh feel alive we want our body the whole body to feel alive so breathe through your thigh inhale and exhale again let go when i say let go that means let go of anything that is again very hard is like rigid you know things like that that actually anything that makes you Tense. You don't even maybe you don't even know. You don't even know. But when you're the more and more you get into it, you will know more and more what's making you tense and what not. So it's just the, again the point to be in touch with yourself. Last time, inhale, exhale, and then just loosen up and take it to the front. Pull your knee towards your belly. Inhale, exhale, and then let go. And now it's an option. It depends where you are. Uh, again, like, a, you know, if I'm in a hotel room, I can do it, but if you're somewhere where it's maybe not that appropriate, you just skip it. Okay, so um, we kind of uh, worked on, on the whole body, I, and I, I'm almost positive and sure that you feel better. I, I actually feel it, you know, and even though I'm not really focusing on my body right now, because I'm focusing on speaking and I'm focusing on you, guys, uh, I still feel it. My body still immediately feels more alive and more present. And I think that's what we want to do. But we still have to open up a little bit the hips because they tend to be very close. And they say, and I kind of believe it, that um, opening up your pelvic, your hips, is uh, opening yourself to creativity. Uh, and to life, well, you know, sexual energy, passion, it's there. And then if you open up your chest, there's a heart and you connect it, passion and love, and then it's perfect. So that's what we want to do. So let's do the frog. So take it to Namaskara Mudra. Just um, connect your palms in uh, front of your chest. If you touch your heart, inhale and exhale, you go down. Your knees are going to the side and just open up. But make sure that your back is straight and still. Even though you're all the way down, still the inner power is going up. And now feel it. What helps is to push your feet down like you wanna like you wanna go up. The feeling is always up, 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 up. I just can't stop <laughs> saying it because it's so important. Uh, and I want you guys to feel really good, you know, so that's why I'm emphasizing it. So again, like you're all the way down in the frog, your back is straight, your core is there 
that's important. It doesn't have to be super strong, but it's there. You're aware of it. And you're pulling yourself up. Relax your shoulders. It's not about your shoulders right now. So inhale. And maybe you will feel a little bit of sexual energy. That's great. Last time. And then just let go and relax. Maybe stretch again a little bit more forward. And I hope you feel the energy flowing much better. Of course, if you have time, space, then just lay down and uh, stay in Shavasana for a little bit. If not, it's okay, but maybe you just sit down and for maybe one minute, you just let it go again, you just breathe and you just let the energy just settle so it's there, so it's there, so, it's, so you're not right away somewhere on the train again. <laughs> Even though if you are, it's okay. I think everything is okay.